Okay, so recently returning to the UK, we are spending this period coming up to Christmas investigating places around Milton Keynes. And today we have come to Newport Pagnell, which I had no idea was so pretty. This is the High Street. I'm immediately impressed by one very important thing. Free public toilets. Free public toilets. Can you believe it? It is so pretty here. Look up here. Look. There's a little pub. How cute is that? And then the high street with all the lights on it. Okay, the focus isn't great. There we go. Oh my god. Okay, so we're off to investigate Newport Pagnell. Might go to that pub later. Can't say. Check out this building. This is a building society. How cool is this building? Oh my god. I love this place. It is so pretty here. It's like a proper old-fashioned high street. It's so cool. Check out this shop. Had to go in here. Oh my god. That place is like heaven jars and jars and racks and racks of the best sweets oh my god sweets check out this place and wow look it's just so cool up on the high street and it is just rammed full of all kinds of cool vintage stuff vintage clothing vintage handbags and now he's seen something over here that he says he wants that I'm not having in the house because that is scary as hell. I don't like that. But my God, what an amazing shop. What an absolutely amazing little shop. So cool. Just the coolest shop. Look at it. It is just so damn cool in there. Oh my God. Okay, so here we are on the high street in Newport Pagnell and this pub, uh, it's the Swan or called the Swan Revived, I think it is now. It's a hotel. 1681, it's a hotel, but this is supposed to be one of the most haunted places in Newport Pagnell. So in it's definitely, no, in the UK in fact, as yeah. I've just been corrected. So this is definitely somewhere we need to come back to. Let's spend a night here, that'd be fun. I'm scared. Certainly feels weird. It feels very weird. Very, weird. very, very weird. Even I say it's weird and I'm a skeptic. Yeah, he's a mega skeptic, but um, yeah. There's a funny feeling about this place for sure. The Swan Revived, I think it says. Yeah. Creepy as hell. Okay, so uh, right next to this haunted pub. There's an alley. Sorry, it's so noisy. We're in the countryside. Look, there's a tractor. Get your head out of the way of the fairy lights. Yeah, down here to the side of this uh, haunted pub, the Swan Revived, there's this little alleyway. And it is super charming and cool and gorgeous. How nice is this? Oh my word. The frog and nightgown. <laughs> and this is the walkthrough from there's like a little bridge that comes from the graves. And there's these little cottages all the way across here that actually look out onto the church. And some of them have actually got, you can't see it from here, so there's actually a, a tomb virtually outside somebody's door right there and then they're looking out onto the church i think it's snowing there's kind of raindrops coming past but it's freezing so it could start snowing and then there's views all the way across there and then what oh my god i'm actually i'm sorry i didn't realize people that there's gravestones on the ground here how cool sorry everyone if we're disturbing you and there's just amazing church Good evening everyone, sorry if I'm stepping on you, I didn't mean to disturb you. Um, yeah, just absolutely beautiful. Hang on, there's the church tower up there. I know the pub next door is 1681. You see in there to the stained glass windows on the other side, hard to see. 
and then the church tower up there. This is absolutely gorgeous here. Looking through the church to the other side, back towards the cemetery. It is just stunning. I definitely recommend a trip to Newport Pagnell, which is uh, just outside of Milton Keynes, to anyone. I look at the carvings on this door. Just gorgeous. And imagine living right there. What a view out of your front door. Sorry, that's not focusing that well. Just gorgeous. Gorgeous. Anyway, this rain might be turning to snow pretty soon, so uh, probably going to head back to the car. <laughs> But hey, Newport Pagnell, definitely worth a trip, I'd say. Sorry about the focus on some of this. My hands are freezing. There we go, that's better. Okay, so just finishing up on our lovely trip to Newport Pagnell. Came across this cute little arcade. It's just amazingly charming around here. Just so cute. We've got barbers. Milkshake bar, beauty salon, card store, a little balcony up there that's so cute. And a uh, oh, nice vape shop, uh, vape shop. And then the, ooh, the gourmet burger joint, very nice. Feeling a bit peckish after my walk. And then um, back out onto Newport Pagnell High Street. And that concludes our trip to Newport Pagnell. Absolutely gorgeous little town. I will be back.